Hello Aries, welcome. I'm Moran. thank you for being here. This is going to be a general reading, so of course everything may not resonate. Take what it does and leave the rest. And for more tarot readings after this, please check out my wife's channel, Prophet D3 Tarot, which you should read for you as well. Thank you. Is jumping right into this you are feeling very creative creative you're feeling very creative um it seems like there is something you want to definitely put together and work on but yet at the same time you're also wanting to do this in a very specific and particular way now that being said i do see that whatever these ideas are that are flowing you're showing up very happy and fulfilled with it it's like you've discovered something at the same time like i said it's a matter of how you work with it not only internally but also externally as well as Kind of like saying if you have an idea and you're wanting to write it down how is the process from the mind to the paper or from the mind to the pen to the paper going to turn out the result um you're wanting to be very very specific and detail focused with this it almost seems like you have to kind of check in with yourself even initially before moving forward with this task or this endeavor and that's what's very interesting. It's an energy of internalizing, internalizing, internalizing. And so much internalized energy is kind of building up. But yet you're also focusing it very well, too. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's, that's like, um, you're getting ready to set cell Aries. You're getting, you're getting ready to depart something. Um, maybe that's what it's all about. It's about moving forward, the journey forward. Because you're showing me this nice energy of reminiscing about, you know, where you've been, how things have gone how things are going presently, as well as your focus strongly on where things are headed, more so, more than anything. Um, it's a nice energy though, it's a very nice energy, it's real smooth. Okay, a little, <laughs> little bittersweet though. It could be for the chance of a new job, new career, new position, maybe a promotion, don't know what that's about. Um, something there though there's something there but like i said it feels like bittersweet um leaving something behind that you have so much of a strong emotional connection to but also like i said it's about progress it's about movement forward um letting things go moving on to what new can be brought your direction or brought your way there's, yeah, there's a realization there though you're saying intuitively it just feels like time Oh geez, what is that about? That's that's a little bit of um, that's a little conf you, you're showing me a little bit of uh, feeling conflicted there. I don't I don't know why or what's going on with that. Oh geez, what is that? Um. If that's between you and someone. I'm not I don't feel like it is. I feel like it's between you and you, but it could be between you and someone. If it's between you and someone, they're not making it any easier. But I feel like it's you. I feel like it's you. There's 
I have to say it, Aries, there's a slight bit of energy here about lashing out. And it, it's the energy of pain. It's kind of like saying an injured animal is a little bit more dangerous because you, they're a little bit of a wild card. You don't know what they're going to do, how they're going to act, how they're going to behave. Ultimately, it's that fight or flight mindset, that, that nature kind of kicking in. Um, I don't know what that is. You're kind of showing me this energy and this drive where initially it kind of feels like if I have to fight for it, I'll fight for it. But then at the same time, you're also kind of saying like, I'm also kind of tired of having to fight for it. And it's like, understandable. I kind of feel like for you, it's an energy. If I have to fight for it and keep fighting for it and keep fighting for it and keep fighting for it, fighting for it it's like, what am I fighting for? What's all this fight for? Where's all this energy going? And you're kind of like saying, yeah, I feel like it's been flushed down the toilet. I don't want to do it no more. And the more you kind of learn about this, the more you're kind of like, yeah, no, this, this doesn't feel like it's it. Um, yeah. All that energy, all that time spent for what? Oh, geez. Hmm. Um, What is that about? I feel like it could be between you and someone. I feel like it could be between you and someone. You're saying there's definitely some sort of talk or communication you're taking place, but it's, it's almost like when you need to kind of get your mind right. It's like you need to take a little bit of time for you just to even be okay or be energetically even ready to communicate or express something to someone. Maybe it's an energy of like we need to talk about us or don't know, but... Yeah, time, 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 time changes everything. It can change things in a positive way, it can change things in a quote or perceived negative way. Uh, but you're just showing me times are changing, times are different. And unfortunately the way things are going between you and this connection, um, things are just different. Things are absolutely different. It's not a, it's not a, you know, positive feeling. Now what's, what's very, un, I was going to say, what's very unfortunate about this Aries is this connection, unfortunately, you're supposed to be going through what you're going through with them. I am looking at five, five, five. I don't know why you're supposed to be going through it, but you're supposed to be going through it. I kind of like the, the, the pain the pain, the upset, the difficulty is trying to show you something. You know, it's like sometimes if it's worth it, it's worth the fight. But at the same time, if it's so extreme and difficult to make something work, it's not worth it. Knowing when to fight and knowing when not to fight. You're, you're kind of showing me, it's like, I need to figure out what I'm going to do here. Uh, what my next step or plan of action is going to be. I'm upset I'm not happy about it, but I also need to figure out, once again, it's, it's that same energy I believe I gave you in a reading recently of, um, I believe it was titled like gaining the vantage point or something, like looking or seeking out the higher ground to kind of figure out like where you truly ultimately want to go, what your direction in life is, whether it be with someone or whether it be without them, either or, don't know. But of course, if you are dealing with anyone, you could be dealing with a fire sign, an earth sign, a water sign, and that is all. Goodbye.